Okay, YouTube guys, just a little video of how uh, I took out my freeze plug out of my truck. I got an 04 Silverado 6.0 engine. Uh, I know there's not a lot of videos out there pertaining to this, but uh, this right here, you see what you got right here is a freeze plug and it busted out of my truck. You're probably wondering which one because there's a lot of areas you can't get to. So let me give you a close up view. I don't mind that. That's just my little full seat I just I just purchased purchased over here. Don't worry about that. Uh, this is my truck over here. Just the motor with the 6.0 in it. Uh, let me give you the location where this freeze plug was at, and I'm gonna let you know everything I did to remove it. Uh, sorry for the camera view. I just ain't got no good help these days. You know how it is. So. We got the freeze plug coming out the motor. So the one I'm mostly got lucky on is this one right here. It's close to the block. It's right there by the water pump. You really don't need to take it out. It's just, you know, simple. I know most dealers want to go ahead and charge your armor and the leg. But I'm going to give you a quick tip on how to remove it. Um, first of all, I sprayed some of this aerocroil. They use this as my job uh, to loosen up rusted bolts and all kinds of stuff that might be stuck. Probably want to order some of that. But what I did was I sprayed some of that around the that circle on there, around the around this around this plug. I, I put some all around there, let it sit for a little bit, and then what I did was I got this screwdriver. And I was just ramming it, ramming it in, more or less right there in the corner, little by little. And then I went a little bit on the edge, a little bit on the edge, and then and then finally it gave loose. But my worry about it was that I was gonna hit it too much, and it was gonna fall into the to the block. Until I went in there, and I put my finger in there to see what was in there, and you have like a little space in there that I think they made it like that where it won't fall mostly all the way through because you can't go at it real hard so if it does eventually try to then you uh, go in there and get stuck you could go ahead and get it out what happened was this was on there and then all of a sudden I twisted a little bit twisted a little bit and then finally it gave in I guess that little spray I put on there helped out so once that happened I got my needle nose uh, pliers and I just went in there and took it out and uh, you got to go back with some wool a little bit of sandpaper and just refine that little edge because I think I nicked it a little bit but it goes way beyond that it goes way beyond that so I don't think it'll, it'll matter because the freeze plug goes all the way in um, this uh, really saved a lot of time money I was initially going to rip take off all the water pump and take off all the fan shroud and all I had to do was just take the intake out you know I just tapped it in got my screwdriver actually this one's a little bent I bended it a little bit so I could get like a little 45 coming out the side you see something like this it was kind of like homemade you see how it bends like that she said and then poked it a little bit like that, poked it a little bit like that, and finally started giving in, started giving in. I sprayed it again, and then finally we got it. Um, I had gone to the grocery store, started leaking. I had my little boy in the back, and all this smoke started coming out, so I just rushed back home and figured out, or, you know, it leaked out. I knew it was leaking, but I didn't know it was gonna leak out a lot, so finally a pin, little pinhole started making it leak, and, uh, that's it. I'm just going to go to the store, go buy another one. I'll probably make another video on how, how to install it. I don't know if I'm going to go with the rubber freeze plug or the, you know, the, car, the brass one. So, um, other than that, that's all I got to say about that. It wasn't too hard. You might get it where it might get stuck. And then, you know, you had to pry out all the center of it out. Pry the, the center, pry all the center of it out. 
and then go on with this you have to take the integrity off of it first and then do that but we got lucky on this one and we'll see you on the next run peace out